What is up guys? Welcome back to another Instagram tutorial. My name is Steven Womack and today I want to show you something a little bit different to what I usually show you. I want to show you that highly requested Frank Ocean blonde cover and the picture to me looks like a film picture, like an analog picture and I have many presets on those film looks, Kodak looks on my website. The link is under this video. They're in the all presets pack along with many other presets such as a Travis Scott, ASAP Rocky, Drake, Tyler the Creator, Gunnar Stahl. So check that out to create that film look. But today I want to show you how to change the color of your hair because this is what you wanted to know for this specific picture. And you will need an app called Facetune. And the first thing I want you to do is open up the Facetune app right here and then choose your picture. Now I've chosen this picture of Frank Ocean along with um, Tyler the Creator right here. And now you go to tones right here at the bottom and choose your color tone at the palette right here. So in this case, let's say we wanna, I think blue would look kind of cool in this picture. So we choose our blue tone, maybe this one right here. And then you hit the screen and now you can just zoom in with both fingers to the head and just try to, and this is really important, just slightly move over the hair first to make it look real because if you press too hard, you will really see too much of that color. So really just slightly stroke along right here, try to even it out a little bit. And now you see I press too strong on the left side. So you can also always take that erase tool right here and just go over that again to just soften it out. and. Then you just have to take your time and really just smoothen it out, make it even, make it look good. And once you accidentally come across that corner or paint something else, you can always hit that erase tool and then zoom in and just try to repair that area right here. And yeah, that should do it. Um, this is it and I think we nailed this right there So we hit the check mark and then you can always export it and I think it turns out really cool Of course if you really take your time and put some more effort in it You can always get a better look But this is the quickest and easiest way I found to change that hair color So I hope this was what you were looking for once again if you want that film look I have many presets for you on my website the link is under this video there's Kodak Portra, Travis Scott looks, Tyler the Creator looks, ASAP Rocky, Gunnar Stahl. A lot of these looks as presets to just easily paste to your pictures. So make sure you check that out. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the notifications bell so you don't miss out on any of my future tutorials. And if there's anything that you want from me, you want me to take a look at next, just DM me on Instagram at Stephen Womack. I'm trying to read and to reply to all of your DMs. So do that if you want to contact me directly or you can also just comment under this video and I'll try to reply as fast as I can as well. Now thank you so much for watching. I hope I'll see you in the next tutorial. Until then, peace.